We love getting your questions, so we want you to keep them coming via Facebook, Twitter, and on our webpage. Who knows, we might just answer your question here in the studio audience next. Welcome back. Spirit and I have been chatting with Christina, who has asked for help dealing with the pain that causes her to be an emotional eater. Mm. And Christina, it's been amazing that you've led us into this journey. And the one thing that's clear to us, we talked about it on the break, is that it's just been a long, tiring journey. Yeah. Yeah. And we think it's time for you to get some help. Thank so you. we've invited uh, a friend of ours here, Drew Lesser, who's a hypnotherapist. So Drew, come on yeah. up. Drew, it's, it's uh, not often, a lot of times if uh, seeing someone like Christina here who um, has experienced a lot of pain, it's been a long journey, but just seems so ready. And uh, so that's why we wanted to, to, to bring you up and to bring you here. And to, What do you think? Here we see an incredible young lady who is really holding herself back and we're going to use hypnosis with you to affect a significant change. Okay, yeah. Now what would that look like for her? Because you know, our audience, a lot of folks have heard about hypnosis, but they have no idea what that looks like. I mean, Christina, for you, when you hear him say that, what do you think? I see your face. I'm, I'm thinking, wow, I've never done it. I've read about it because mm -hmm. I studied about it, but I, ooh, like, you know, I'm from yeah. North Carolina, I go to church, so I don't know about <laughs> hypnosis, but yeah. I'll try, you know. Yeah. Yeah. So, Drew, if you could show Christina what it would look like to be involved in, in the process of hypnotherapy, I mean, could you show, give her an example of what she could expect? Of course. Okay. Can start by now. If I could have this chair removed, that'd be great. Thank you. Okay. Fantastic. So, what I'd like you to do is just lean back and just get yourself into a r relaxed state. And I want you to just take a deep breath in. And when you take a deep breath in, Hold it in for the count of three, and then just breathe out for the count of three. So we're just getting your breathing organized. Perfect, so take another deep breath in, hold it in for the count of three. And when you breathe out this time, what I want you to do is I want you to slowly close your eyes and breathe out, and just feel yourself going down, down, deeper and deeper into relaxation. And I'm just gonna to touch your shoulder when I touch your shoulder, you'll feel yourself slipping down, down, further down, deeper and deeper into relaxation. And what I'd like you to do is I want you to just visualize in your mind you standing on the stage performing and feel the exhilaration, feel all of the incredible feelings of excitement and happiness and all of the adoration of everyone around you. And I want you to really experience what it is that you're wearing in this experience. Watch what you're wearing. Feel the lights upon your face. Feel the heat upon your face. Feel the adoration. Listen to the sounds that are coming to you from all of the people around you are feeling this amazing excitement. And what I want you to do is I want you to hold on to this experience because with every breath in, you feel this experience become more and more real, more and more powerful, and you almost create a greater level of contrast, a greater level of saturation, increasing the color of this visualization of you performing and being happy and being successful. And as you do that, and as you breathe in, it becomes more and more intense. And I want you to shrink that right down and I want you to take the image of you feeling nervous, anxious, scared, frustrated as a 10 year old and fill the whole screen of your mind with that image so that you feel all the emotions, all of the pain, all of the contrast of the emotion of feeling good right there, all of the anxiety that's held you back and see that image right there and I want you to turn it into black and white and it fills the entire screen of your mind and down the bottom corner you have there a little colour image and that's that amazing colour image, an incredible image of you being successful, smart, being adored, looking wonderful and looking incredible. And on the count of three, we're going to expand that little color image to take over the entire screen of your mind, that entire screen of black and white image on the count of three. And then I'm going to ask you to open your eyes and you're going to close your eyes. And when you close your eyes, you're going to go 10 times deeper than you were before. 
One, two, three. Open your eyes, now close your eyes and go 10 times deeper. And on the count of three, we're just going to hold on to that great, wonderful, amazing feeling right now. You really just hold on to it. Because on the count of three, you're going to open your eyes. You're going to remember everything that we've talked about. But you're going to have conscious understanding, conscious belief, a conscious acceptance of the new person that you're becoming. And every day, month by month, week by week, day by day, and hour by hour, this becomes more and more intense. This wonderful image of the new you becomes more intense than ever before. And on the count of three, you'll open your eyes, be fully alert and awake and excited to share this new experience. One, two, three, open your eyes. How are you feeling? I just feel like a weight has been lifted off me. It's really weird. <laughs> wow. Thank you. Drew, are, are you willing to, to continue to work with Christina? Absolutely. What can you offer her today? Well, I think we'll, we will do follow-up hypnosis sessions and lengthy sessions, you know, that uh, last for an hour. Are you willing to accept this gift? Yes, I really appreciate it. Because right. I feel a lot better now. <laughs> It's incredible that you leaned in, let us in, let Drew in. I think more of this is going to change your life. We'll be right back after this. We love getting your questions, so we want you to keep them coming via Facebook, Twitter, and on our webpage. Who knows, we might just answer your question here in the studio audience next.